Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Wadia Daffish. I'm a holistic nutritionist and a naturopathic physical training. I've been involved with Enagic for over seven years now. I'm one of the top educators behind this water. And I'm actually gonna show you today the three properties of Kungan water, why it's the superior water to drink, why you're going to, you're going to want to drink it, because it's gonna give you longevity and it's anti-aging. We all want anti-aging. So go ahead, I'm gonna to talk to you right now about these three properties. The first one I'm gonna to talk to you about is what's called active hydrogen. That is the antioxidant in the water itself, because people are always saying, how does water have antioxidants? It's the active hydrogen that's in the water, and I'm gonna show you right now. Now what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna head, I just poured Kungan water 9.5, fresh right here to actually show you guys because you have to drink it fresh because the antioxidants, the free radicals, has a short shelf life of about 24 hours. Once it's exposed to light, heat, air, and vibration, it's gone. It ends up being like dead water, just bottled water if there's no active hydrogen in it. It will still have the alkalinity for a few days and the microclustering, but you need all three properties and you need to drink it fresh. Unlike Fiji, which is just actual bottled water. So now we have all the waters poured for you. And I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this meter, which is called the ORP meter, and it's gonna test for oxidations or antioxidants. So I'm gonna show you which water is good for you or which water is bad for you. And all you have to do is just look right here and see it for itself at the number of the screen. So right now it's giving me a positive number, telling me that the air has oxidation in it, which is true. That's why it causes uh, rusting to all fruits and vegetables as soon as you cut open an apple. Here we have Kungan water. As you see, I place it in Kungan water, and it's a negative five, 550. Here we have Fiji, and as you see, Fiji drops all the way down to a positive 230, 240, still rising, 250. As you see, it has oxidation. We want that negative ORP. Here's Smart Water, same thing, positive 280. Here we have Aquafina, same thing, positive 290. Here we have that aqua hydrate. Now as you see, it's a positive 300, which is actually supposed to be better for you because it has supposed to be saying a pH of 9.5 and there's nothing but oxidation. Here we have Perrier, same thing, positive 358. Here we have Propel, positive 450 and rising, 460. Here we have Gatorade, 470, positive. And here we have Soda, which is 480, positive. Going back to Kungan water, as you see, it's now it's a negative 500 still. Remember, you're looking for that negative sign. That's the active hydrogen. That's gonna reduce all the oxidation, which is the free radicals in your body causing all the aging. There it is there. All right, next thing I'm gonna show you now is the pH. The reason why the pH is so important is because alkalinity is the epitome of health. We were born from an alkaline environment and acidity is the breakdown of the human body which causes all lifestyle related illnesses and when we die our body decomposes so we don't want acidity. Now here we go. I'm going to take these pH drops, means potential for hydrogen, which you can same thing as you're going to test your pool, and I'm going to place these drops in the water. We're looking for a purple color because the purple is the color for alkalinity and look what we have here. Boom, a bright actual purple. That's what I'm talking about. Now we have Fiji. Let's take a look at Fiji and it's a green. Right? So not only did it pass positive for oxidation, but actually it's showing to be a green, which is more of a neutral. We want the best. Smart water, showing you that it's actually not so smart. As you see here, it's kind of like a yellowish green and it also tested positive for oxidation. Here we have Aquafina. And as you see here, woo, it's like a bright orange. We definitely don't want that, right? Here we have Aquahydrate. Oh, it's the same thing. It said it's supposed to be a positive 9.5. But as you, I mean, a 9.5 pH, but actually it's not. Here we have Perrier. And as you see here, same color as yellow. And then here we have Propel, Gatorade, and Soda. And as you see here, these right here are dark orange is red. And as you see here, this is something that you don't want to be drinking because it's very, very acidic. And as you see here, everything across the board, and this is what we call living water, dead water and illness in the bottle. And actually watch what happens when I actually pour 9.5, which is the living water, in each one of these containers. It will actually alkalize all of the waters. And that's what we're looking for. We're looking to alkalize our body from all the acidity it's taking in. Now watch very closely to the Perrier, it's what I love the most. It's actually gonna to try to alkalize it, but the carbonation and Perrier turns right back to acidity. And here's Propel. When it comes to Propel, sports drinks, anything like that, Gatorade, 
sodas, Red Bull, Monster, you need like two gallons of Kunga water just to neutralize the acidity, I wouldn't even drink it. Wouldn't waste your money on it because look what happens if you just drink a little bit of soda when you're drinking something that's alkaline, it reverses it right back to oxidation. Here we have a Gatorade, thinking that it's good for you because it says electrolytes, but all the electrolytes you need, which is minerals, is actually in Kungan water. So there it is there. Now you're seeing the superior water to drink to hydrate the body for antioxidants. And of course, now I'm going to talk to you about the third property, which is very, very important. Remember, we don't want to look like a raisin. We want to look like a grape. We want to keep our body hydrated at the cellular level. A lot of times when people drink water or liquids, they're always feeling full, heavy, and bloated. So therefore, they're not, allowed, they're not able to drink the amount of water they need for superior hydration, which is ounce per pound. Remember, just to actually keep the body maintained for hydration. Doctors tell you six to eight glasses a day, that's half an ounce per pound. But we actually, for therapeutic results, you need ounce per pound. But how can you do that when you're drinking liquids that are making you feel heavy, full, and bloated? When it comes to Kangen water, it's microclustered, meaning the molecules are very, very small. They're about five to six molecules. The cell can only handle seven. When it comes to all these other beverages, they're anywhere from about 50 to 250 molecules, which cannot penetrate at the cellular level when the body can only handle seven. So let me show you to explain it because I'm a visual guy. Here we have green tea. How do you normally make green tea at the house? You usually have to take hot water, right? Because when you boil hot water, what happens? You're actually shrinking the molecules of the water. That's why when you boil water, it starts to evaporate. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some actual, some boss, some regular bottled water. I'm gonna pour it into this cup with the green tea. Am I gonna get any tea? Absolutely not. Why? Because the water has not, hasn't been boiled. Therefore, the molecules of the water haven't been shrunk. So as you see here, it's not able to penetrate the tea bag. But I'm gonna take the same tea bag now, and I'm gonna use actual Kungen water, because Kungen water has gone through the electrolysis process, it's been ionized, and the molecules have been restructured, meaning they're actually very, very small, for superior hydration. And as you see here, I pour a little bit into the, to the cup, and voila, I got instant green tea. Now, a lot of times when people say that, they say, hey, the tea bag was already wet, but don't worry, I'm actually gonna do the same thing over again. I'm gonna take the same green tea bag, and then we'll use Voss again, and we're going to see if we can get the same results. Unfortunately, we're not. The molecules are too large in this water, the clusters are too large. It will not, it will not penetrate this, the tea bag, so therefore it's not going to be able to penetrate your cells. Now watch what happens, I take the same tea bag again, and I'm going to put it right here in this glass, and I'm going to use Kangen water, and as you see here, I get immediate green tea. Now let's talk about immediate hydration at the cellular level. Keeps your body hydrated, keeps your body looking young, and that's what our body needs. Now look what happens when I just take the actual same tea bag and I just pour a couple of drops in each one. This is what I love the most, is as you can actually see for yourself, I'm gonna actually take the remaining of this boss, pour it in here and see if I can be able to pick up the remaining green tea in the cup. And as you see, nothing happens. But with just with Kanye water, it's so powerful when it comes to hydration, it will pick up the remaining drops of the green tea and spread it throughout the glass. And that's what I talk about hydration. That's powerful. That's what our body needs to stay hydrated. Now the next thing I'm going to talk to you about, what I, what I find is so amazing that this water can do when it comes to, it has all these other properties, there's over 100 applications this water can use, and I'm going to show you one when it comes to cleaning your fruits and vegetables. And the reason why it's so powerful to use is because what are sprayed on our fruits and vegetables? Poison, pesticides, herbicides, sectocides, suicides, homicides, the stuff that's going to kill you, right? And we don't want that on our fruits and vegetables because, you know, it's harmful, and I'm gonna show you what it looks like and how harmful it is. I'm gonna take these cherry tomatoes, and I'm gonna pour these, these cherry tomatoes in these cups right here, okay? Now what I'm gonna do here is naturally, let's just say uh, normally we're gonna use tap water thing your root fruits and vegetables, but actually I'm gonna, and what's in tap water? Fluoride, zinc, aluminum, arsenic, chlorine, soaks right into your tomatoes and you end up eating it. But this time I'm gonna use actual aquafina, right? I'm going to pour it there, and then actually, the best thing to actually use is Kungen water. Uh, Kungen water, actually 11.5 is what you actually want to use. And also what it's going to do is I'm going to show you instantly how Kungen water is able to actually allow your body to emulsify and break down fat in your body, so you'll essentially you'll lose weight. Also, like for instance, when people say, 
you know, cholesterol, but I don't want to talk about other testimonials. I'm going to actually show you the power of it. Now look what happens when I just do a couple swigs here, and I do a couple swigs here. And I'll put these two cups right there. And look what happens when I pour it. Look at the color of that. Look at the color of this. It's clear, meaning pesticides are still remaining on these tomatoes, but pesticides were washed off of these. Reason is, is pesticides are oil-based and water-resistant, so therefore it was unable to clean off the pesticides with the poison that's still remaining, but look at this. This is what you're eating every day. Now, I'm gonna show you how that was able to happen. I'm gonna take actually oil, Sesame seed oil, I want to pour into each one of these cups. The reason why I'm using sesame seed oil because it's just like in a way, it's a pesticide, it's oil based. And as we know, oil and water do not what? They do not mix. Oil floats to the surface. That's why regular water, tap water, is unable to wash off the pesticides. But when you actually use cumin water, I'm going to show you the power of it. Immediately when it mixes with oil, it emulsifies. It breaks up the oil. That's why it's able to wash off pesticides off your fruits and vegetables. That's why it's able to truly cleanse out the body. That's why it's prescribed by Dr. Shinya for colonoscopies. I mean, like the list can go on, but hey, look, right there, there it is there. It will actually remove the pesticides off your fruits and vegetables, give you superior cleaning. You can use it for your pet stains, your floors, your carpet stains you can't get off. It's like the best cleaning agent that you can actually possibly use. And that's just one of the waters that this machine makes um, out of the seven. So there it is there, you're seeing it for yourself.